Imagine if, from just a drop of water or a speck of dust, we could detect any living thing. We now can thanks to environmental DNA, or eDNA for short. All creatures leave traces of DNA in their surrounding environment, via skin cells, hair, scales, anything really. And this is where the magic happens. Scientists have worked out how to extract this DNA from the environment and use it to identify the animal, plant or other organism that left it behind. We start in the field, collecting samples such as water from rivers, lakes, estuaries, dams, you name it. eDNA can also be found in terrestrial samples like soil. Next, the lab coat goes on and eDNA is extracted. The unique sequence of each DNA molecule is analysed for matches against a database of species. Once we get a single or multiple species match, bingo! We then map which species were found where. So from a simple sample, we can determine what is present within the broader environment, making the often invisible visible, making the cryptic species easy to find as we no longer need to see, hear or catch something. eDNA is a valuable tool for those working to protect our ecosystems. We can more easily monitor native species like the popular angling fish, the Murray Cod. In the same way, we can monitor threatened species like the Dwarf Galaxis. We can also detect invasive species like disease-carrying mosquitoes that can enter Australia via our airports and shipping ports. By efficiently and effectively identifying what is present in our environment, eDNA is revolutionising how we manage and protect Australia's fragile biodiversity. If you would like to learn more, please get in contact with us at EnviroDNA. We are a team of passionate eDNA scientists who would love to help.